We're on the farm of Mr. Andrew O'Carroll, who's the current winner of the Tuggle sponsored uh, farm forestry category in the RDS Awards. And could I ask you, are you impressed by Andrew's approach to forestry and to overall farming? Oh, absolutely. I mean, I've got the pleasure of presenting the award earlier in the year to Andrew and Stacia. And, um, but to come down here and to see the plantation itself and to hear his story as, as he explained it, this is land that he, he will tell you up to when he planted it was, was difficult, challenging. Um, he said he could spread lime in it in April without marking the ground and in June the cattle were sinking in it. So it, it just, it was, it was land that wasn't performing and was, a, was difficult to farm. Um, took a decision with a good advice um, from uh, experts to plant this, this block. It has really achieved phenomenal uh, growth um, where he'll be probably thinning this year and after 14 years of growth which is exceptional it has proven to be very a very um, worth wise decision to plant it in 2005 it has allowed him to continue his main enterprise which is sucklers on the remainder of his own owned land and to lease in adjacent land uh, uh, to farm the, the, the circular enterprise, so it's complementary, and I think his his approach to it was pragmatic in the first place. Uh, insofar as the land here was too difficult to farm, it was always, uh, you know, not producing the way it could, it should, better land would, um, and now he's making this a, a positive contributor to the family farm income. Your department recently announced enhanced supports for new afforestation. So do you, do you see forestry as an important resource into the future? Yes, well, the government, the, 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 the afforestation scheme is funded out of the Exchequer, so it's of the order of 106, 108 million annually. Um, our targets are to get the national forest cover up to 18% of the total land cover. We're at about 11, so we've quite a way to go. There's huge potential out there on land that's ideally suited, that doesn't have any restrictions of any des description other than for people to look at it. I think the midterm review that you mentioned was to address some of the shortcomings possibly in the, in the, the programme as it existed, particularly in relation to our broadleaf cover. Would you have a message for landowners, farmers out there that maybe have some marginal land or have land that might be appropriate? Um, and are considering their options at the moment? Well, I think what the message we're really trying to get across is that the department is open for business on this, but we can actually assist um, and support that farmers in their decision and landowners to plant. What I'd ask all farmers to do is look at their overall uh, holding and see if there's land that could actually produce more by way of income, pension possibly, um, provision, and security if it was put into into afforestation and use that money then to improve the, the remainder of the farm or perhaps lease in or purchase additional land so that they can farm in complement with, um, with having trees as opposed to in competition with it. I think they're complementary rather than uh, you know in competition. So I think it's really important that people have a look at it. We are here today at the launch of the RDS uh, forestry and Woodland Awards and do you see merit and would you encourage um, landowners with forestry yeah. to participate in, in these awards? Oh absolutely and I think it's great I mean you can see walking around here why um, the O'Carroll plantation was awarded the inaugural winner of this award um, and hopefully by showing and demonstrating the showcasing it we'll get other people who have um, plantations that are of high quality, well managed, and that they would um, enter their, um, enter into the competition. I think it's really to the credit of Chavez and the RDS for recognising the need for such an award to, 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 to highlight the benefit of the, the farm forester. So I think it's a really um, worthwhile and uh, uh, initiative that has been taken here and I think we should actually promote it as best we can.